Hello and welcome to Mini Orange. Today, we will configure single sign on into HubSpot to protect page content using AWS Cognito as identity provider. Install the Mini Orange single sign on app on your HubSpot account, you can find the installation link in the video description. Choose your account from the list. Click on Connect App button to connect your app. You'll be redirected to the application's configuration window, where you'll need to enter your identity provider information. Here, we are using AWS Cognito as the IDP, let's configure it. Log in to your AWS Cognito account. Search for Cognito in the AWS Services search bar and click on it. Click on Manage User Pools and then, Create Pool button to create a new user pool. Enter pool name and click on the Review Defaults button to continue. Scroll down and click on Add App Client and then again click on Add an App Client. Enter App Client name and click on Create App Client button. Click on Return to Pool Details to come back to your configuration. Now, click on Create Pool button. As you can see the user pool was created successfully. Now, click on the App Client Settings option under the App Integration menu and enable the Cognito User Pool option. Enter the callback URL which you will get from the Mini Orange SSO app, under the callback URL field. Select authorization code grant as OAuth flow, and allowed OAuth scopes by clicking on it. Click on save changes button to save your changes. Click on choose domain name option and enter a domain name for your app. Now, you can check its availability by clicking on check availability button. After entering valid domain name, click on save changes button. Make sure you have the complete domain name handy. This should be entered into the Endpoints field, under the Mini Orange Single Sign On app. Click on Users and Groups option, under the General Settings menu and then, click on the Create User button to add a new user. Fill all the required details and click on Create User button. You can see the new user created, now, click on App Clients option. Then click on Show Details, to get a client ID and client secret, keep the client ID and client secret handy as you will need it later to configure MiniOrange SSO app. Go to MiniOrange SSO app, and enter the client ID and the client secret, which we have copied from AWS Cognito. Enter scope as open ID. Make sure you have disable the send in header parameter, and enable the send in body parameter. Enter the Cognito endpoints, you can find those endpoints in our setup guide, in the video description we have provided the link of the setup guide. Click on save button and then, click on test configuration button. Log in with your user credentials. After successful login, you will see all the values returned by your AWS Cognito to HubSpot in a table. Here are the setup instructions and the code snippet. Please copy the code snippet and keep it handy as you will need it later. Now, go to your HubSpot dashboard and click on Marketing and then Landing Page option. You can choose any page. Click on Edit option against your page. Click on Settings option. Scroll down to the Advance option, and click on it. Paste the code snippet, which we have copied from the Mini Orange SSO app. Now click on Update button. Click on the page URL, it will redirect you to your configured identity provider login page, log in with your credentials. You will be redirected to the landing page successfully. Thank you for watching this video, if you have any questions, please contact us at HubSpot support at securify.com.